Welcome back. This practice is evaluate the function for the given value. Let's get a function. The function says the rule is negative 4 times x. Remember here it says input and this is output. Also remember function is like a machine. Let's put a simple function machine here. I need open here so something can come out. And every time you put in a value, we call it x, which is our domain. And by the rule, the function rule says the input has to multiply by 4. And then it comes our output, which is our range. OK, this is a quick review of what is domain and range, what is input, what is output. Let me give you the value. The value says when x is negative 2. Let's read it. f of x equals negative 4 times x. So when x is negative 2, so in my little function machine, I'm going to put a negative 2 in it. And then when I say x again, I'm going to say x, you are negative 2. Now I'm going to evaluate it. Negative, negative, we're going to have a positive. 4 times 2, that is 8. We're done with this one. All right, let's write another new function rule. Let's say this time we have f of x is... How about let's get a fraction. 5 over 2x minus 6. x is... Let's try positive 2 this time. Remember, this is a function rule and input. This time, input, I'm going to input a positive 2. And the function rule says, whatever you put in, you have to times 5 over 2 and minus 6. Remember, this is a positive 2. We're going to put down here. All right. OK, 2 times 2, 1 is on the top, 1 is at the bottom. Therefore, 2 divided by 2, that is 1. 1 times 5, that's 5. And a 5 minus 6, this gives us negative 1. So you can see when input is 2, the output is negative 1. Same thing here. Input is negative 2. By this rule, the output is 8. And we completed two questions today. Good work. Happy learning.